Command is a pretty rare theme. In fact, it is the most uh, it is the most rare theme of all 34. Only five percent of our database have command in their top five, and that's something I'm. People always ask me why that is, and maybe that's something El can explain uh, later on. But we'll uh, we'll try to think about uh, command, what it looks like in its its raw form, what it looks like in its mature form. I think command obviously is an is a theme about influencing. And uh, there's lots of different kinds of influence. I think it is especially helpful in situations where there may be some resistance, where there may be some opposition. This doesn't mean anti, but just it's about persuading sometimes. It's getting people to go along with you and and pushing people to do that. Um, I think sometimes it helps to clarify a theme by contrasting it with another theme. So a pretty typical contrast is command and harmony. And I'm just guessing, Al, that harmony might be lower on your list. Oh, yes. It's <laughs> down in the bottom five. Yeah, yeah. And uh, <laughs> that's that's what I would call a logical pair, kind of a high command, low harmony. And But it's interesting enough, both of these themes are about emotion. Uh, mm -hmm. People with harmony really try to manage strong emotion in in order to maintain momentum. If we can get people to get along, we can keep moving. Whereas people with command use strong their own strong emotion to get something moving or to get someone moving. It's it's the use of emotional power and presence. And obviously, and I, I know Al's going to talk about this a little bit, that's a pretty volatile ability <laughs> when you think about using strong emotion productively and effectively. But, uh, but obviously, it can make a big difference. Another uh, couple of themes that you can contrast and compare would be activator and command. And uh, I think Al's got some of both of those. Mm -hmm. So, uh, But one is more about getting something moving kind of going from zero to nothing it's it's creating momentum the other one is a bit more about dealing with opposition when something is slowing you down when something is pushing against you and so um, so that's just another way to think about it sometimes people like it when we come up with different words for this theme that help us to understand it so words like decisive is I think a command word clarifier or clarifying, driven or driver, uh, persuasive or persuader, challenging or challenger, uh, assertive, uh, take charge or control. Um, an, a, a metaphor that I like for command is fighter. Now, that might not appear to be the best metaphor, but I often use the illustration of you can be a really good fighter or you can be a bad fighter. <laughs> and so if you think of the range of Muhammad Ali as a fighter, literally a fighter, who was perceived, had a very positive uh, uh, reputation, I think, in our world. I mean, he kind of gets to hang around with world leaders. I think he helped open up some of the Olympics. He was perceived in a positive way, even though he was a fighter. On the other hand, and I hope he's not online here, is Mike Tyson. <laughs> uh, here was a fighter that was known for biting people's ears off. So you see the range of how people can be fighters and how they might be perceived in a positive way or a negative way. Um, I like to think about uh, some some sayings that that sometimes help to capture the essence of uh, of this theme. So for example, when the when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Uh, that's that's kind of a, a command saying. One of the things that I've often said about uh, command is that it's people who are most comfortable when they're in the driver's seat. It's really about people who are good at taking charge and bringing control. And uh, I think sometimes control has a bad name, as if being out of control were a preferred state. And uh, uh, these are people who know how to bring some control and some uh, some order to to the world. Um, 
you know, something that I've always wondered, and this may be something people in chat can kind of think about, is there a is there a fictional character, either in TV or movies or literature, that somehow represent this theme? And I'm so if there's anybody out there, if that's something you want to start chatting about, and and then maybe Jim can let us know of which one of these things has kind of, uh, uh, if anybody comes up with some new ones. Another one might be a song. <laughs> A theme song. Is there a song that kind of captures the essence of uh, of what command could look like? Uh, let's see. What else? I think something else that I think is important to think about is uh, the the themes that are most often paired with command. The theme that's most often paired with command is strategic. Mm -hmm. And um, and it makes some sense that it would be that way. The themes that are least often paired with command are discipline and developer. 